Hey everybody, how's life treating you? Russ Robo here. Just wanted to give you a quick update about the change in channel schedule. Uh, it's going to be a little bit different for a while uh, because I've been noticing that lately the videos that I've been uploading, they're, they're good, they're okay, but they could be better. And I wanted to take some time to actually just like uh, try to increase the quality of the videos. The main three criteria that I'm looking at, which YouTube looks at as well, for determining the validity of a video's quality is actually um, frequency, consistency, and frequency, consistency, and quality are the three aspects that I really wanted to improve. Uh, the main reason is because if the videos aren't really that great, they're just sort of okay, uh, people won't really, they'll, they won't really share them with anyone. They're not really shareable. So I wanted to focus on increasing the quality of the videos. And in order to do that, I need more time to actually process them. Recording the gameplay is actually the easy part. The, mo the more difficult part actually comes with the editing of the videos. Um, I was thinking about taking a day to record the videos and then a day to process and edit and upload the videos. Because with processing, that means you import them into your computer or on a, onto a flash drive or into your editing software. Then you start the editing process. That means you cut, you, you, know, you paste, you put music in, put the clips in. That usually takes an hour or two. Then you upload them. That, you know, for a standard 30 minute video to hour video, a 30 minute video usually takes an hour, an hour long video for some reason usually takes an hour and a half. So I was thinking about uh, one day I'll, uh, let's basically, one day I'll basically record the video and up and process it and then the next day will be for uploading, generating the thumbnail, all that different good stuff because uh, the thumbnail has to be specific as well. Uh, before I was taking just screenshots from whatever content the video had available. And sometimes that works for some videos, sometimes it doesn't necessarily. But I wanted to basically upload every other day, three days a week instead of every single day. Because I've been noticing that uh, for about two weeks I was able to upload a video every single day, or two and a half weeks every single day. Legend of Korra came out like that. It was going good. But I realized that that was when I first started trying to, you know, bring the channel back up to speed, sort of resurrect it. Um, but, and I talked a little bit about that earlier in the December update. So, you know, like from when I started the channel back in 2013, and I didn't really upload anything for the longest time. And I wasn't really, you know, I didn't really have any knowledge of how to upload and how to make videos. And now I'm sort of learning a little bit more, trying to get a little bit more traction going. So I, what I wanted to do was basically increase the quality of the content while uploading three times a week on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, or however else works for the channel. I don't think it'll change for a while. It's just something I'm trying to do to sort of increase the quality of the content because I've noticed that even when I'm trying to upload daily, sometimes I'll miss a day. And then I'll upload day, uh, you know, for two days in a row after that. Then I'll miss two days. Then I'll upload another day. Then I'll miss two days. And that inconsistency is actually hurting the channel more than it's helping. It would be better if I uploaded better quality videos left less often than just trying to shove a video out every day and getting it uh, every day for a while and then stopping that inconsistency actually hurts the channel a little bit more than it actually helps. So hopefully it will help create better thumbnails. All I need, all I know that I need to do is basically fix that on the channel art for Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. Um, as far as I know, I just need to fix that on the channel art and update the channel art for that. Uh, and that should be good. Hopefully it'll actually make it better for the audience. Because if the video content, if the content is better, that makes it more shareable. If it's more shareable, that makes, that gets it better views. And YouTube isn't really about, you know, overall views nowadays, except for the, you know, the 10,000 views you need overall in the channel's lifetime. 
to actually qualify for a review for monetization, which doesn't necessarily mean you automatically qualify for monetization. It just means you get a review to see if your content is actually in compliance with YouTube's policies to enable monetization. And then maybe you can get monetization. It's not even a guarantee. So uh, I was thinking that basically I wanted to try to increase the content of the quality that I have available so that in the future it'll be better for the viewer overall. I do, however, have a lot of plans for future uploads. Uh, the Skyrim series is rolling along. Uh, I wanted to add uh, another series, um, Warhammer 40k Dawn of War, or Dawn, uh, what was it? I think it was Dark Crusade. It's uh, in order to replace Besieger, because unfortunately I can't continue the Besieger series, uh, because Windows 10 is no longer compatible with that game. Um, Steam usually updates the client patches for its games to actually keep them relevant and up to date with the new Windows operating systems. So most of what I get off of Steam is actually compat uh, compatible with my computer and its operating system, which is why you see a lot of YouTubers, um, if they play a game for their channel, it's usually a game that they bought off of Steam. Steam is like YouTube Central for anything you want to play on your games. That's why you notice as soon as Honey Pop comes out, everybody's playing it. As soon as Cuphead comes out on Steam, everybody's playing it. When Honey Pop comes out on Steam, everybody's playing it. Uh, right now it's uh, Doki Doki Literature Club. It comes out on Steam, everybody's playing it. As soon as something hits Steam, boom, everybody's there. Because they know that usually with Steam, as soon as you hit it uh, on Steam, that it's good for your computer, it's good for your operating system, it's optimized for Windows 10, and you know it's going to work. But hopefully the new plan for the layout of the upload schedule for the channel will actually help me practice making better thumbnails and practice making better content. Because that's really what I want to do, because if the videos are more shareable, they'll get more views and they'll just be better. They'll be better for the viewer. If it's not good for the viewer, it's not going to be good for me or the channel. So hopefully that'll help everybody in the long run. I hope this uh, answered any questions that you have. If you have any other questions, let me know in the comment section below, and that'll be about it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope it answered any questions you have. And until next time, take it easy, my friends.